What do you guys think of E if I didn't say it? I think personally, if I didn't say it is a very, very, very interesting concept for me. To say um there are no cows that are coming Guam Juli, Guam wherever. But because this current situation we're in allows both me and you the convenience of being able to live together, let's do it. And what shall become of it shall become of it. I mean, if five years down the line, I now decide I finally found my parade, it is for you to move. I mean, also, is that fair? So, the fact of the matter is all relationships come to an end in one way or another either by mutual agreement by the partners to separate or through death. And this could be in a civil marriage, uh, customary marriage, civil unions, and in this context, fat and set relationships. The problem is that fat and set relationships, commonly known as common law marriages, are not recognized in South Africa. So you, as a person in a fat and set relationship, would have to take extra precautionary measures to ensure that you are protected in the event that there is separation or death of your partner. Because there aren't legal systems that regulate fat and set relationships, you would have to put in place things such as drafting a will. Your will will obviously direct what happens to your estate upon your death, for example, or get into a domestic partnership agreement, which sort of directs what happens when the partners separate. There will always be disputes, though, between family members and the partners in a relationship because they would recognize that the partners aren't legally tied to one another. And because they are blood relation, they have a blood relationship with one of the partners in the event of death, they have a claim to the estate if that partner did not leave a will. So make sure that you ensure that all Necessary factors have been included before entering a fight and said relationship because they are risky. I would discourage fight and said relationships because they will, and this is if you're very invested and if you've invested a lot in your relationship, monetary, where there were shared responsibilities, both contributed to the household. It is likely to end up in a court of law where disputes have to be heard in court because the line is not clear. Don't do it. That's really all I have to say. Like, at what point did you have the discussion to say, this is what we're trying to do, this is what we're building. Also, this whole thing of building, nobody should be building anybody else. I feel like if you're, as a homo sapien, in your completeness, are looking to extend what you call your abilities and your goals and you just being with somebody out of companionship, that is wonderful. But if you and your whole being are construed, created and co-created under the guise of I'm here to build this one, then you build them and when they build, they decide to go with somebody else. Whose fault is that? I mean, at no point did we discuss me getting built was the whole point of this. Me, I'm here because I want you and you want me and this is a relationship.